was homeless, I was at a staffing point in my life because the only thing I could worry about is where I was going to eat, where I was going to sleep that night. I had no idea where I was going to get my lawn gun, where I was going to take a shower. And now that I got my place, I'm able to start working on the goals that I had as a kid. I know that I'm 36, but life ain't over even though you're old. I mean, now it's time to start working on my dreams because dreams are made to come true. It's all about the work you put in. Well, see, how do I like my apartment? I mean, where can I start? I, I get to wake up next to my lovely dog here. I get to wake up not worrying anymore. I'm able to worry about the real things in life, the things that are going to better my life. Like isn't a word. I'm infatuated. I'm just happy that they were here for me. I mean, finally, somebody listened and gave me a chance. Now it's my turn to show them that, I'm, that I appreci appreciate everything he's gave to me. I mean, I don't even know where to start. I'm just, I'm just happy. I'm finally happy. John, you do all the work around the, uh, the lawn and the bushes and stuff? Yeah, um, the landlord at first, because I had to pay for a dog fund a little bit, I was doing all the work. Now, I keep up on the grounds, I keep up on the basement, I shovel, I rake the leaves, I do everything around here. And the landlord goes back to Amy for more clients because I'm showing them just because you're homeless don't mean you're a bad person. It's just some people need a chance, and they gave me that chance. Now, I just don't want to mess it up. John, introduce your dog. We can hardly see him over here. This right here is my best thing in life. Without him, I wouldn't have no one to cry to. Why? He's a great person. Why? Because I don't have my own kids. And he's the only thing close to a kid. I don't know how to explain it. Landlords out there to give bad names to dogs. Look at this one. It's the greatest thing you could ever have. And what's his name? His name's Brownie. I know he looks just like the Taco Bell dog, doesn't he? Yeah. <laughs> the reason why my dog's very important to me is because a person like me, I can talk to people, but I've been talking to people since I've been a kid. There's something, it's something about an animal that's able to make you let everything out. And you know they're not going to turn their backs on you. I mean, I'm able to cry. I'm able to get mad. I'm able to yell. I'm able to scream. And he's still right there for me. He's the only thing that's really ever stuck by my side. I mean, having an animal is the greatest thing on earth to me. I don't know how to explain it. I'm, just, I'm a lucky man to have a great dog.